using the IFC link, this video will show you how to import an IFC model into a project as an object model, and then look at the various ways this object model can be utilized, such as framing various elements of it, and how to export a BD draw model to an IFC file. This video assumes that you have an existing IFC file. IFC files can be exported from a number of different BIM compatible architectural drawing software programs. However, we advise that you check with the software provider for further details and instructions on how to export from them. It is also important that you use a Z 3D level template project. First, we will look at importing in an IFC file. Go to File, Import, IFC Import. Now choose the IFC file you wish to import and click the Open button. You will then see a window in which you can define the stories and objects to be imported. In this column, you can see the IFC story along with its height and what 3D level in the project it will be imported to. BD will automatically match these up where possible. There is an additional function here to automatically adjust your 3D levels, where you can then alter the 3D level that is adjusted. In the Objects column, you can select what object types you wish to import, and if they are included in the 2D presentation. Click OK and the file will be converted as per the settings. This may take some time depending on the IFC size as BD will update all geometry. Once the model is brought in as individual IFC and components, these will need to be converted from the IFC model into Vertex. Doing this allows us to update the original IFC model should a new one be received. Thus, these are then independent from the original IFC. We would then be able to see any changes if the model is updated. You can also select the various parts from the model tree for instance all of a particular wall type, then right click and build part from IFC. The conversion window will appear. Here you can create conversion rules, selecting walls to convert to from the library. You could also not have a conversion rule and just convert the wall to an IFC wall to retain its features. Simply select the walls to convert, then press the convert button. Once converted, you can select the wall, right click and change IFC wall to vertex wall, then selecting from your wall libraries. Once the walls are converted, you may need to use the wall flipping and wall end connection tools to get the model ready for framing. Once done, you should then be able to frame and generate the NC files as per the usual vertex methods. For exporting a vertex BD model to the IFC format, first go to the file menu and then in the export submenu, choose the IFC export command. You are now able to select the object types you want to export as well as the drawing model pairs. For instance, we could use this button just to export the framing. If a site origin has been defined, you can toggle the coordinate to this or alternatively just use the building origin. Now select the save location and file name of the IFC file and press OK. The IFC will be exported ready for sending on. This concludes our video on the IFC functions within Vertex BD. Thank you for watching.